To enter a big piece like this, which is about 14 feet by 10 feet, you have to find the story. I didn't paint it, you understand? It's the actions of the world that have made it paint. I really wanted to explore some materials in the region. We went to a local market to acquire these ones. Some of them have already been used by people that used it for 10, but it's, they no longer use it. So, which means it has a lot of uh, amazing energy in them. Charcoal is one of my favorite medium to work with. It's one of my very first material I could use while I was growing up in the village because you can just grab the charcoal from a fireside and go at your mother's wall and just start scribbling on them until she come and give you a little bit of whacking. <laughs> the title now is for those who slept in the dark with identifiable ghosts. Sometimes those that cause nightmare for others are those that they know, they are those that are close to them. So it's something that has to explode in whoever is looking at it and you have to look very carefully because there are things that you yourself have not seen now that are there. The falcon here is very symbolic because it has the olive leaf for peace. The falcon is a bed of prey. But it also can, you know, how can you make falcon peaceful to the extent that it becomes a pet? You know, have very peaceful birds coming here uh, all the time. There are pigeons that, that hang on the windows, free birds and stuff like that, you know, so. But they are not the one that you need to like talk about peace to because they are already peaceful. So what is the matter for there is that, look, the people that you feel like, okay, they are more powerful, more military sophisticated and all of those, those are the guys that you have to preach peace to. Mm -hmm.